Scott Doe supporters by the millions flooded Times Square for the eighth night in a row to celebrate the election of America's newest folk hero, the president-elect John Doe. Not perhaps since Lincoln has a candidate risen from such obscure beginnings to see uh, the ultimate prize in American John Doe politics. doesn't exist. It's Tempest. It's Tempest. Clark, where are you? Mr. Wells. Lois, brace yourself. I've brought... Clark! Oh. No, my dear, it's not Clark. Well, at least not yours. I'm sorry, my dear. I know this must seem an awful trick, but you remember this clock, don't you? You helped create his Superman in the alternate universe. Even in that world, Tempest wanted him gone. What he couldn't do there, he's done here. Lois, I know how bringing Clark here must look. That any thought of retrieving my Clark is hopeless? That the only thing that stands between Tempest and world conquest is Superman? Is that what you think I think it looks like? I'd say the world could use a Superman just now. Lois, I'm not your Clark, but I can be Superman. In my world, I've become the Superman that you encouraged me to be. I know this sounds awful, but I really don't want you here. It's like having Clark, but not. And accepting you means accepting that he's gone, and I'm not ready to do that. Clark would want me to stay. How do you know what Clark would want? He'd want me to protect this world. He'd want me to protect you. On your cookie dough ice cream is... <gasps> Clark! Oh, Clark, son. <gasps> Martha, this is not our Clark. It's not our Clark. Whose Clark is it? Perhaps I can explain. And who are you? H.G. Wells. The writer? Aren't you dead? Uh, only some of the time. Martha, Jonathan, H.G. Wells can travel through time and space, and he brought this Clark here from a parallel universe where we all exist, but in altered forms. Oh, I see. But you look so much like my son. And you look so much like my mom. And dad. Uh, And in that place where your parents were. My parents died when I was a kid. I never thought I'd see you, them, again. Clark, I'm sorry. What, what? I'm sorry for forgetting that as rotten as all of this is for me, for all of us, that that must be pretty hard for you, too. Lois, I'd really like to help. Are you okay with it? Yeah. Then I shall be on my way. Perhaps I can locate your clock. <laughs> 